So it looks like I triggered Darius Truxton. I triggered Queefy Boy, right? Finally? No, 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 no. Look at this comment that is on the screen. This is a, a community post that Queefy Boy, Queefy Boy wrote after I uploaded my video yesterday. He writes, ha, 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 ha. I just provoked that jobless loser Slotham to cry about me at two in the afternoon. Well, here's the thing, Queefy Boy. Darius Truxton, 2772. Oh, I'm very sorry, Robert. Didn't mean to disturb you at all. Here's the thing, right? I've been doing this, uploading at 2 in the afternoon, for the last 6 months, roasting you every single day. So you saying, oh, I provoked him to make a video at 2, that doesn't make any sense. I always make my videos at 2, whether you say something or not. Whether you're chinless from one angle or double chinned from another angle, I will still upload my videos at the same time. Everyone knows my schedule of burying you. Everyone knows. Monday to Saturday, Monday to Friday, you get buried. Saturday, I analyze a pic of yours and make fun of it. And Sunday, another episode of Sloth and Buries the Darius Truxton Army, right? That's how it goes. That's my schedule. It's already known. So you saying, oh, I provoked him at two. That doesn't make any... That's like saying... That's like saying... <clears throat> I'm outside of elementary school recess and at two o'clock the bell rings outside and I tell my friends hey guys you want to see a magic trick at 2 p.m. I'm gonna make the bell ring outside of school and they're like oh wow cool that's what you're doing queefy boy here's the thing though here's the interesting thing to t tell you all all of you you know who is triggered? You know who is provoked? Darius Truxton. Why? Because he's been changing stories nonstop. That loser that probably washes dishes at Bojangles like an idiot, that piece of garbage, what did he say? What, what happened when 2772 happened? He ran away like a little coward that he is for two to three months. The crotch grab, the crotch grab strategy wasn't going to work at that point, right? Because this is YouTube. You're going to continue to get buried, queefy boy. So he ran away for two to three months. Then what happened? Then what happened? Oh, he came back to friggin' uh, Ricardo Cody's or uh, uh, D. Reed stream. And what did he say? You guys are the reasons that S S S Slotham is successful. And you guys are the reason that Darius Truxton doesn't make videos anymore. Another change story. He, he ran away for three months like a coward that he is. And then he came back and blamed you guys in the Truxton army for his failure. And then what happened? Then what happened, right? Oh, then he tried to pull this whole thing like... He just wants to p watch cable TV, right? And, and and talk about wrestling with his three loser incel stream viewers and talk about friggin' and play his little queefy boy games on Nintendo, banana yellow Nintendo Switch. That's what he changed his story to, right? And now look what he's doing. Oh, and then after that, what did he do? He Albert Menencuck. You're the reason the drama is happening. Hey, James Campbell, don't watch Slotham. It's a victory for the snakes, is it? Yeah, that's what happened. And now look at him. Now he's finally coming to realization that no matter what you do, Queefy Boy, I'm going to continue to roast you on YouTube and turn you into the LOL cow that you truly are. You have been LOL cowed off the platform to the point where you have some garbage bit shoot and rumble uh, channel that no one watches it's complete garbage and even my videos are on there on the rumble and bit shoot what are you gonna do about it how are you gonna stop my wrath hey that's another wrath my my wrath is so strong that you had to respond right now you're doing these little keyboard warrior community posts it doesn't matter you're gonna continue to get made fun of. hey moron you're the same loser that proposed to Ursha Gaming with Amiibo toys, right? Or are you trying to show her that you're so tough now that you're responding to me? Hey, Ursha Gaming already knows that you're a loser. Ursha Gaming has already seen my videos of me clowning on you and completely exposing the fact that you're a complete loser that friggin' married a girl in Final Fantasy XI and then creeped her out in Final Fantasy XI. That's you, Queefy boy. Hey, Darius Truxton, you want to talk about me? Oh, I just prov provoked that jobless loser at 2 in the afternoon. Hey, moron, you're in your mid-40s. Have you learned how to drive a car yet? Huh? Have you got your license yet to drive a car? Yeah, and bumper cars at the CNE don't count, idiot. I'm talking about a real car, real highway. I'm talking about 100 kilometers an hour speed limit on the friggin' highway. I'm talking about that. Have you ever done that? Do you even know how to operate a car? Do you even know how to switch the gears into park and neutral and drive and all? Do you reverse anything like that? Yeah, the R is for reverse, not R is not for retard like friggin' Carl, that fat Q-tip 
using belly button fat piece of trash Carl, that obese loser that put this little troll job uh, story out there. Like, oh, you got redlined by a freaking shot. Shut up. No one buys it, you prick. My God. Everything you tried, Darius Truxton, everything you tried to stop me from roasting you has failed. Your whole little take trying to take the heat off you and put it on Albert Menendez, that failed. Not even your own Truxton army does even like you. No one likes you. Everyone hates you in the retro gaming community. You can't even show up to game conventions because you're going to get made fun of. How does that feel, prick? And worst thing of it all, you can't even go to parks anymore. Why? Because Coach Booge. Coach Booge is hiding behind that big tree waiting for you to get there so then he can lift you up, knock you to the ground, and try grabbing his crotch. It ain't going to work. You're such a piece of trash, Darius Truxton, that your mom thinks you're filthy, your dad thinks you're the sorry sack of crap that you are, and your sister doesn't like you, and your sister's kids don't even know you exist, moron. You're so pathetic that you simped to Rochelle Rachel and asked her to call you and that didn't work, right? You, there's so much evidence of you being a loser online and you always try to deflect. It ain't gonna work. And then in your video, you're trying to say, in your little live stream, you're trying to say, oh, my piano is fake. Hey, loser, stop being so jealous of my piano play. It, it, you guys in the trucks and army are so jealous of the fact that A, I can rant, B, I'm smart, C, I can drive a car, D, have a career, and E, I can play piano on top of a video game. You just cannot handle that fact at all that I'm the complete package roasting you guys on the trucks and army side. And now to the next screenshot that I am going to show. Level one online completely buries Queefy Boy. So Queef, this is what Queefy Boy says in his community post. So apparently the 30 year old virgin Slotham and his wrath consists of him crying every day and repeating three year old lies made up by alpha nerd and some some look at that um typo there some some he stuttered Darius Truxton is stuttering when he types that's how weak and pathetic he is stuttering while he types because he's been defeated some some middle-aged obese man in his parents house seek help little boy Get a job while you're at it too, instead of crying like a baby at two in the afternoon. So is that your new strategy now? I've been literally uploading videos at two in the afternoon Eastern time for the last six months. And I guess Sean Murray, that fat cupcake eating lard piece of trash with a dad who also is a fat cupcake lard eating diabetic piece of trash. He said to you, oh, hey, why don't you use this point? It's always at two in the afternoon. Why don't you roast him on that? Well, good job. Ah, you completely succeeded. Yep, Darius Truxton back on top, king of rants. Here he is on a keyboard being a keyboard warrior and this is what level one online says look how queefy boy stammered his in his typing some some he glitched out when i came into his mind why because i own his entire life just take your l and move on already little queefers i got you fired from franklin empire empire fact that is actually true don't let darius truxton tell you any differently don't let him tell you any differently level one online got queefy boy fired from franklin empire that's how pathetic queefy boy really is oh queefy boy you want to make little videos in your break room think you're so cool well guess what take the biggest l in your life you ever have get fired from your friggin job and then uh level one online says i got your channels taken down that's a fact how many channels did darius truxton lose more than i can count and what happened to his little 1500 600 channel that got taken away queefy boy can't even build a friggin community anymore of over 500 600 700 subs anymore well guess who did i did i'm over a thousand subs and i got that adsense and i'm monetized and that's the way it's gonna be so hey queefy boy keep losing channels as soon as you think that you're full of confidence that Murray NG8 is freaking editing your videos and giving ideas. Guess what? You're going to lose another channel. And then what are you going to do, Queefy Boy? Stage three meltdown, cry on the internet and say you want to watch some more cable TV. Let's continue. I caused infighting in your community. Fact, that's 100% true. Look what's happening in the Darius Truxton army. Who is even in the army left? 
let's say we got that racist piece of garbage Dave C, that other racist piece of garbage Sierra Air, and some autistic loser with a wife getting Tyroned DJ running. That's who you have left in your community, all right? Then you got these other wannabe trucks and army incels like Dean TV with a failed YouTuber, failed rapper, failed wrestler, failed father, friggin' waved away his rights to his eight year old son at the time. You're, you should be ashamed of yourself, Dean. You should be ashamed of yourself that that's what you did, you loser. Then you got Albert Menencuck, friggin' some homeless five foot two shrimp who's been MIA. I know why you're MIA, Nos Nosferatu. I know why you've been uh, hiding for the last three to four days, uh, Albert Menendez. Do you really want me to say it on YouTube? Do you really want to expose that information? No, I'll keep it. I'm not like that, all right? I'm not like that. I'm just waiting for you to rant back. Yeah, so sit there and shut up in your blue tarp in the friggin' Florida Everglades. Then he got friggin' D. Reed. D. Reed, I have something for you on my Sunday stream to show how much of a cuck you really are. You just wait for that. And then he got Cyan Rager sell some genetic freak with a chin like Buzz Lightyear leeching off his millionaire parents. Doesn't have Cyan Rager sell literally never has to work a day in his life ever again because he's got millionaire parents. So yeah, all that infighting happening in your uh, friggin' crappy little Truxton army. Let's continue. Hold on. Like completely humiliated, embarrassing you. Yes, he did. We got that video of Darius Truxton getting lifted up, beat up to the ground, grabbing the guy's crotch, right? We got 50 reasons why Ursha Gaming shouldn't marry me. It just goes on and on and on. So here's a suggestion. Go grind a little bit in real world, build yourself up, and come back when you have something better to show, such as a car, other than 300 hours of Tears of the Queefy Boy. You literal Queefy Boy. LMAO. How does that feel? Hey, guys, remember when... Um, Darius Truxton said that he's gonna take a, a break from YouTube and work on it work on himself Remember when Darius Truxton said he's gonna work on himself and better himself And then when he came back all he had to show was 300 hours of Zelda tears of the kingdom That's how much of a loser that piece of garbage is queefy boy. Hey queefy boy continue to get buried Anyone can bury you now. There's so much evidence out there to bury you now We move on to the next screenshot that I'm gonna show on screen so A Volpe releases another DM, right? So yesterday I showed you a DM of A Volpe saying that uh, Darius Truxton said in a DM to A Volpe, he only cares about himself. I want you really to get that in your head. He's literally said that. that I told you guys from the beginning, I told you. I told you, Darius Truxton is a selfish prick that only cares about himself. All you guys in the Truxton army are just being used. And that's exactly what's proven. So then now Darius uh, A. Volpe releases another. He releases another um, screenshot right here. And this is what it says. This is what, this is what Darius Truxton said to A. Volpe. Awesome. Yeah, man, I'll always have your back. Just please tone down the doxing and only do it to the snakes. There you friggin' go, huh? You guys in the Truxton Army wanna say, oh, doxing's bad, doxing's bad. Oh, the snakes only dox. Oh, these people only dox. Here you have Darius Truxton admitting to A. Volpe, hey, dox, but do it to the snakes only. So there you go. How does that feel, James Campbell, you prick? You wanna talk about suing if you get dox? Why don't you go after Darius Truxton here? He's literally saying in a DM that he wants to dox people. How about that, prick? Hey, Dean TV, Albert Menendez, you pieces of garbage, huh? Doxing's back. Why do you always take it to doxing? Why can't you just stay, stick it on YouTube? Hey, why don't you tell your leader incel, Queefy Boy, to stick it to just YouTube, right? He's the one doing it there. He's using people. He's you, he used you, Chief Debo. You friggin' loser that blocked me from seeing your comments. I don't know why you did that when I could just go on my friggin' with no account and see all your comments. I don't know what your thought process is there. I can still see your comments, idiot. But it just shows how weak you are, Chief Debo. Chief Debbie. Queef Debo. The guy who steals gameplay footage. That got friggin' used by Darius Truxton until, until oblivion. And then got friggin' bent over and stabbed in the back. Just like you should. And then you got tossed to the ground like you should. Huh? Living in your grandma's basement there, Chief Debbie. How does that feel? Look at Queefy Boy here. Oh, only docks and only do it to the snakes. There you go. That's Queefy Boy in a nutshell for you. One, he uses people and says he only cares about himself. And two, he says, yeah, docks and docks those people. That's Queefy Boy for you. Some piece of garbage that's going to continue to lose online over and over and over and over again. Hey, Queefy Boy, you have no money. How does that feel? You have no car. How does that feel? You have no girlfriend. We know how that feels because you actually hired a stripper to go with you to the Blue Jays game. That's how pathetic you are, huh, Queefy Boy? You're an incel.
all right? You live in a friggin' apartment that smells like cat piss. You got cat feces all over your ground and you never cleaned your litter box because you're a lazy prick. And for God's sakes, for the love of God, for the last time, clean your stupid dirty vent in your stupid kitchen and there's nothing you can do about it except cry on the internet.